Hi folks, in today's video tutorial I'm going to show you how to create direction pattern and I'd like to thank you for the question because you have leave it under my previous tutorial. So let's start, we will start to create new 3D model and you can specify the name, yes, so and we will create directly on the base default datum plane some easy shape so we can create symmetrical rectangle yes so we will use the symmetrical rectangle and dimension approximately 300 to 400 yeah it doesn't matter for the quick explanation so i like to extrude over here downstairs and for example deeply 25 doesn't matter and we can finish in the middle we can create a hole and if you would like to create hole in the middle, you can directly on the fly create necessary datum axis. Yeah, so select with control button two datum plane system will create a middle axis. And with middle button, you can continue. The system asks you where you would like to start to create a hole. Yeah, so if you will select the placement, it's from the datum axis and the surface reference. You can specify the diameter or depth. So for example, diameter will be 10 only, it will be small one, and that will be through all. Yeah, I think that size is okay. I don't want to see anymore for now the planes, datum planes, so we can hide. And the question was how to create the pattern feature. Base it on this hole if it is placed directly in the middle. And what does it mean? We will select the hole and you can choose from flyout menu the pattern feature or from the ribbon yeah it's up to you and right now you can see that dimensions are not here because i don't want to pattern the diameter i'd like to use the offset for this one so i will change to the pattern feature from dimension to direction and system ask you select the first reference so you can choose the first reference you can specify the increment value and for example every 15 millimeters yeah you would like to have the couple of holes how many holes will be all together for example 10 yeah if you would like to change you can use this dragger and the system will show you how the system will specify the increment so for example 20 for this example will be good and the question is over here is the additional icon flip the direction so from the selected reference you can flip for example left and right and what does it mean if i will confirm the system will create altogether will be 10 holes the question is if it is possible to create in the same pattern feature the more than one holes in the one row yeah so we can simply add the definition and as the second reference i will select the perpendicular datum plane and the system again to show me where and how many features i'd like to create so you can change the orientation or flip section direction here yeah from the selected references or you can simply drag so please move where you want and for example four holes you would like to create so what does it mean it will be 10 per four and again if you will finish the system will finalize everything what is here then the question is for example you don't want to create a couple of holes here so it's not problem you can select the definition and for example choose simply with selection left mouse click on the mouse and the system will do not create these holes so it was example how to use the direct pattern or definition by direction the question is that if you would like to make some more preferences yes of course it is and for example you you can use the function in the option that the general option what does it mean general pattern means that if you will have a more than one surface the system will create it if you will use the variable on identical for example identical means that you would like to create only on the selected surface yeah so for example if i will choose the identical and the system will break the surface it will be not finish it correctly and you will have an error message yeah so it was explanation that 
you would like to manage the visibility and if the system will show you the errors or not. I like to use the general pattern because the system can create on any surfaces and the system can calculate it. If you will use the variable or identical, the system can calculate a really, really huge amount of numbers of the pattern members much faster. Okay, and if we will finish this feature, the system will create what we really need. The question under my video tutorial was if it is possible to create the symmetrically maybe for all sides. So yes, of course, right now you can create a mirror feature and then it will be definite like you need. But I will prefer to delete pattern. The original member will still stay here and I will create a sketch here before and we can use, for example, offset functionality and offset loop. And you can select the surface and use the function next or previous. Confirm value and system will create the boundary for the next feature. And in this example, I'd like to show you that it's possible to use the pattern feature, the whole, but the sketch has to, ex has to be created before the feature, what we would like to pattern. So please use drag and drop and move sketch up to whole and then you can choose the whole as the pattern. But right now I will show you that it's possible to use the fill pattern. And fill pattern will automatically create the features where we need and you can specify the increment or you can specify your custom orientation here yeah? so you can see here that program guys prepare for us a lot of nice shapes and you can specify the angle orientation distance and so on yeah or you can specify the offset value from the boundary so it was a quick example how to deal with question if your first feature is placed in the middle of the object and how to use the pattern. First of all, the direction pattern. A second example was how to use the fill pattern. Stay tuned, like video, and bye bye. Vladimir.